Spiders are just about everywhere. And even though spiders help to control insects and pollinate plants, they often get a bad rap, and lots of people still find them terrifying. So I want to know, why are people afraid of spiders? I did a little research, and here's what I found. A lot of people have an intense fear of spiders and suffer from a disorder called arachnophobia. I think the main reason people are afraid of spiders has to do with what a spider looks like. A spider has a fused head and thorax, called a cephalothorax, an abdomen and eight legs. Spiders move in a herky-jerky motion that a lot of people find unsettling. All spiders have body hair. Spiders rely on their hair to sense vibrations in their environment, for defense and to attract mates. Small hairs on the tips of their legs help them to climb up a wall or walk across a ceiling. A spider with lots of hair looks bigger and more intimidating. To me, the hairier, the scarier. And let's face it, a spider's head is terrifying. Most spiders have eight eyes, but some have fewer. A spider's eyes help it detect the movement of prey or predators. I think the most horrible part of a spider is its fang-tipped jaws, known as a chelicerae. They're used to hold onto prey while the spider injects its venom. But don't worry, only a few spiders have a bite that can penetrate a person's skin and venom toxic enough to hurt you. And most people aren't happy to come face to face with a spider. But before you squish it, stop and think. Spiders are performing a valuable service for people and the environment by controlling the insect's population. So don't squish a spider. Instead, capture it in a jar, then release it outside so it can continue to do its job. So what did we learn? Many people fear spiders because of the way they look and act, but most spiders can't hurt you. However, that does raise another question. What are the most dangerous spiders in the world? I want to know.